Greetings to the Moto Vlogging community, subscribers, and fellow YouTubers. Tractacular here. Today, aboard my new ride, a pre owned 2016 Harley Davidson Road King, who we've christened the name King. So, welcome to King. I've always enjoyed the stylings of the uh, Road King. It has that classic throwback Harley Davidson styling. I've demo rode them a number of times from uh, the model years 2014 right up to 2017. And uh, always enjoyed them. Some of the models I found to be, uh, the throttle was quite sensitive, perhaps it needed a bit of adjusting, but I was looking on a website in our area for pre-owned uh, motorcycles by, for sale by um, um, non-dealers. This was a private purchase and um, it had just over a little, little over 4,700 kilometers and in excellent shape, no dents, dings or scratches. Uh, it was well kept, uh, garage kept and uh, unfortunately the fellow that had to sell it uh, was due to health reasons. So it was quite an action packed day. Um, we had to travel about 20 miles to a different town to uh, see the motorcycle and then go a little further into the city to um, write out a Canadian bank draft on a, from a Canadian chartered bank. That was the uh, seller's request. and. Uh, we had no problem with that. Came back and delivered the bank draft and uh, then went back into town and um, got the insurance papers for it. Rode it back home uh, a distance perhaps of a little over 20 miles with my dear wife Mrs. Tractacular following behind in our vehicle. She even reported me a bit from the back. Um, she was able to stay behind me the whole way, which was good. So she recorded me for a little ways on the cell phone. Because I have uh, very little video of uh, myself riding from uh, behind, just a wee bit with uh, my good friend and uh, fellow British Columbian moto vlogger, Moto Nut. So as of this uh, moto vlog, I still have Raven, my 2015 Yamaha FJR, but will be putting it up on websites to try and sell it. I really enjoyed the uh, Yamaha FJR. It was a new model, 2015, that I purchased in 2016, uh, a holdover model on the showroom floor. It was brand new, but just the um, rider position for me with the um, shins and knees having to be bent back I started to get quite a bit of cramping in my um, right hip. So, I've enjoyed the time I had with it. And uh, it's an excellent bike. Super smooth engine, that inline four engine. Uh, I don't think you can really go wrong with any of the uh, major metric uh, producers of motorcycles they're all all just so uh, well refined and reliable but 
There's just something about the mystique and the, the character of uh, Harley Davidson, the classic throwback looks which I enjoy. This 2016 model still has the 103 engine. It does not have the new Milwaukee 8 engine, but it's all the power and more that I need. I'm cruising along here in uh, fourth gear at 60 kilometers an hour and from when I've demo rode a 2017 I didn't really notice any difference in the smoothness of the ride at, at these higher speeds just that there's a little more pickup they say um, you can go perhaps two motorcycle lengths faster if you're going from 80 to 90 miles an hour but realistically when can you do that our, our speed limits on the freeway it's a maximum of 110 kilometers which uh, I believe is just a little over 70 miles an hour so I'm just out today this is my real inaugural run with it my first ride out on it aside from when I rode it home and so I'm just out and about this morning and uh, gonna go to one of our regional parks take a little break have some water we've been having a hot spell here in British Columbia, Canada here towards the end of June so I will do a walk around of this motorcycle in uh, future motor vlogs so I'd like to thank you for joining me today on this exciting ride Hope you're all able to get out and ride as well. I welcome your comments. Please like and subscribe. So until next time, take care and ride safe. Bye bye.